Radio Giornale Belunese, now airing. Daily news from the Belluno province. Welcome to a new edition of the Radio Giornale Belunese. These are the news from today, February 17, 2023. Tragedy in Misurina. A 20-year-old tourist died on Col de Varda ski track. The young man was found dead in the afternoon. The search started because he had not returned to the meeting point he had decided with his friends. It's unclear whether the death was caused by a sudden illness or by, his, or by him crashing against a tree. A 56-year-old woman fell into the Vezes torrent in Santa Giustina. It happened yesterday, at 16.30. The medics and firefighters came to rescue her. She was injured from the 2 meters fall and needed to be brought to the hospital. Fire risk. Declared by the Veneto region the state of high risk of forest fires in the Belluno, Vicenza and Treviso provinces. This is due to the drought and higher than average temperatures. Any activity that may start a fire has been forbidden within 100 meters of any at risk area. Two men from Puglia had processed for swindling an ice cream maker from Belluno. They used stolen checks to buy ice cream machines. The value of the checks was 21,160 euros. The two accused men are also accused of swindling another man from Belluno, this time for the sale of a bike. Accused of illegal practice of the biologist profession, a woman from Feltre. According to the prosecution, she worked as a nutritionist, despite having no degree and not being registered. The events date back to the period between 2017 and 2020. Politics. After the Lega's Provincial Congress, violations in the voting arrangements were contested. In this, if these violations were found to be true, they could invalidate the meeting in which Andrade Bernardin, Rocca Piedras Mayor, was elected the Provincial Secretary. Passing to sports, hockey. Cortina won 2-1 against the team that holds the first spot in the rankings, Gesenice. Cortina will play again tomorrow at 19.15 against Salzburg. Volleyball, Serie A 3. Rejected a Papineto's appeal, the team contested a presumed error of the referee in last Sunday's match. Victory was given to the RL Belluno, which will, however, have to pay a thousand euros fine for access of the public. On Sunday, they will play against Savigliano, which holds the fourth spot in the rankings. Finally, football Serie D. Dormiti Bellunesi will have, a, uh, will have an away game against Campo d'Arzego, which holds the sixth spot in the rankings. And that is all for this edition. We show nice day come to Radio BM, the Belluno del Mondo Association's web radio. You just listened to Radio Giornale Belunese, daily news from the Belluno province.